So you think you've got it rough. Well, just remember there are robots out there performing jobs that we humans don't want to even think about. So here we go. Top 10 dirty robot jobs, one through five. Now in the old days, human waste department workers had to dig up pipe sections and diagnose the problem firsthand. A task as expensive and time consuming as it is disgusting. And that's where this guy comes in. Meet the Red Zone Solo, a pint sized sewer tank with a knack for navigating 8 to 12 inch diameter pipes. Old Solo works alongside a bunch of humans who send him down manholes to explore with his 360 degree digital vision, GPS, and onboard intelligence for autonomous operation. You've probably seen your share of Roomba vacuum cleaners in your time, but this is their cousin, the Scuba 230. Roughly the size of a personal pan pizza, this little guy is designed to squeeze in right next to the toilet tank and clean up all that splashed man urine back there. Working in 20 to 45 minute sessions, the Scuba 230 washes, scrubs, and then squeegee vacuums up to 150 square feet of pea splattered bathroom. Scuba handles the floors, but what about inside of the bowl? Well, Ariel University created a toilet washing robot prototype that actually lives inside your commode. He looks the other way while you do your business and then hops to action when you leave, reaching in with a mechanical arm to brush out the bowl entirely. Now what's that you say? You don't need a robot to help you go potty? Well, just wait until you're older. Wait until you're older. Meet the patient transfer assist robot. Now sure, this may look like a cross between a Segway and a writing desk, but this mechanical powerhouse uses wheels to move the patient in and out of a bathroom and uses weight supporting arms to lower them down onto the toilet and then back up again. You can think of it as a kind of robot super nurse, only one that works 24 hours a day and won't accidentally look at you in the eyes when you're going number two. The next robot we're going to meet is a little guy, and believe me, that's a good thing. His creators at Japan's Rukoku University and Osaka Medical College call him the Mermaid, and he's programmed to swim right up your butt. The two inch long mermaid, who granted looks more like a tadpole, is the world's first self-propelled endoscopy device. Meaning he's designed to swim through a patient's digestive tract and take photos along the way, like he's on vacation. A task that aids doctors immensely in diagnosing everything from stomach ulcers to colon cancer. He's no weakling either. While other endoscopic capsules depend on the patient's natural muscle contractions to move around in the intestines, the mermaid uses motorized propulsion to swim around inside you. He can even enter the digestive tract at either end, so he can speed around through the works in just a few hours as opposed to the 24 to 72 hours it takes a corned beef sandwich to travel the same road. Now this bot's dirty job is something you do every day of your life. He turns food into poop. Meet Cloaca, the digestion machine. Now the digestion machine here does his business in some of the modern art world's finest galleries. As you can see, Cloaca consists of six glass vats connected to each other with a system of tubes, pumps, and wires. A hired chef feeds gourmet meals to one end of the mechanical installation, which blends it all into a fine paste. Next, this bit of scrambled food stuff travels through a series of acid and enzyme treatments that mimic the chemical digestion process of the human body. Finally, Cloaca excretes a dark, smelly lump of fecal-like matter onto a rotating tray. It may all seem like pure nightmare fuel to you, but Cloaca is the beloved creation of Belgian conceptual artist Vim Delvo, the culmination of his uh, mad poop dream. So there you have it, that's one through five. In the next video, we're gonna do six through 10. But in the meantime, let me know what's a dirty job in your life, your work life or your home life that you would love to hand over to a robot. Let me know on Facebook or Twitter as well as our homepage, StuffToBlowYourMind.com.